we are on the road heading to Pangasinan. Got four hours of drive from Manila to the Hundred Islands. See you there. So I'm heading to uh, go see the edge of this beach over here. We're staying at Maxine. By the sea. Maxine by the sea. Oh look at that, there's more hotels. I like it when we talk I wanna see if there's a, actually a beach. I'm trying to find a good place to fly my job, honestly. But I wanted to be right by the beach. Hopefully, there's a beach at the end of this road. Here we go, guys. Oh, look at that, the ocean's right there. See? Not the islands. But I'm just trying to find a beach so I can fly my drone. I'm hoping there is a way to get to the beach from here. Well, let's see. Just taking a break and I haven't eaten lunch or dinner. I'm eating at the restaurant that's called Maxine by the sea, which is the restaurant and resort that's right on the ocean of the hundred islands. So yeah. And I'm editing right now. It's Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi, 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 internet, internet. Chill. It's only like what? 10? I know, I said. Yeah, it's kind of early here where we're at. Babe, it's not until like 5 in the morning. But yeah. And uh, my sister's getting coffee after we did not just like uh, Korean karaoke. Interesting. I'm getting coffee until the start of it. And it's interesting to be in another country. That's why it's kind of fun to be in another country. Experience different. Yeah, different. Yeah, different customs and you know, just people's culture and traditions. That's the point of life. To learn. Learn. Okay. Beautiful people, we are here in Alaminos, Pangasinan, where the hundred islands are, which I showed you. And the sun is rising beyond the horizon. But yeah, it's a bit gloomy, and apparently the weather forecast is that there is a typhoon that's gonna hit 
The Hundred Islands, or most likely Pungasinan. So right now, it looks like we're not. What are we doing? Okay. Wow. Oh, nice. Ready? One, two, three. One more. So, okay, I had to take a picture, picture real quick. Picture, picture, you know how us Filipinos, we love capturing memories and taking pictures. So yeah, as of right now, there is no boats going to the island. And that's by the US Light too. Because it's, uh, the, the server here at the Maxim restaurant by the sea said that it's level one. So we might get a second chance in the next one because we are going to pass by it again when we we travel from a local store back to Manila so I'm being I keep saying so 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 anyways that is the story as of right now we're about to get breakfast <laughs> and of course my family <laughs> are taking pictures 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 just waiting on our breakfast yes it's kind of dark and gloomy behind me right but it's still beautiful the beach the ocean the clouds the Blue sky. One pineapple. Free breakfast. Well, it's like that majority of like all the resort to hotels that you stay here in the Philippines. It usually comes with free breakfast. So yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm, Food by the ocean. Trying <laughs> Alanis <laughs> Lindy. Mm, that's gonna taste like similar to vegan. Garlic. But yeah, I still do like vegan ones. They're bananas. Look at that crispy fried goodness. Bananas. I found a path that you kind of have to take and it's kind of like, it's not secret, it's kind of obvious. I'm just showing you. Look at this. This path you go through. So yeah, we came from that one, right? Watch what it reveals itself when you get to somewhere. Ta da! Look at that. Look how beautiful this is. Boatmen's, fishermen's, Philippine flag, all the abandoned buildings. But look how pretty cool this is. We go. Onto a path that's never walking too much. But yeah. 360! But yeah, pretty cool.
So I just walked from that wooden bridge right there and I know, went into what seems like an abandoned building. It's not abandoned, it seems like it's used for drying clay pots or like mini storage. But yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and walk back on this wooden bridge. Okay, discovering new things and finding new things. That's the fun part, learning, experiencing it. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, good job. Ah, isn't that just amazing, guys? The scenery, structures, the <coughs> motion of the ocean. The sounds of the waves, the wind, and you can see palm trees, trees everywhere, green leaves. Yeah, nature at its finest. So we stopped by at Manawag, Manawag Church, and I wasn't quite too sure if you're allowed to film in there. But the last time I remember when I went to a church, they told me to put away my camera. So in respect of the religion and the church, I didn't want to film. So, it's a pretty big church though, if you look at it. I must say, it's bigger than the one in Vigan that I've seen, so yeah. Literally stop on the side of the road. Uh, the man's back there, but I saw a beach view with a mountain view to my side, and so I had to go ahead and I said, Stop! It's a mountain view! See I'm up the stairs. Look how gorgeous this view is! on top of a view deck on the side of the road and right over there this part right here is the ocean which seems to be the port of Pablo Sion Pablo Sion shop which is point point you know just point and what you want and just give it to you so, yeah let's go inside Try the soup that comes with the meal that you eat. See this? It's freaking hot. Cheers, mate. Okay. okay, mom, you don't need to say your opinion before I even started drinking it, but okay. I like this one. Agnes! It's Mmm, I actually like the broth. It's good. It reminds me of like bulalo. Stop drinking it. Like 
liking the broth. Sarap. Sarap, sarap. Mm. I'm not too sure what I'm eating that yet. I just grab whatever. I literally grab whatever. I like the sauce in this. Pancit, chicken, yeah. and... Alright, lunch is done. Lunch is great. The food was amazing. You can taste the authenticity of the province in this. So if you ever come here, come to this store. See some. See some. See some. Bagus kami pencet. Ah, kalau merong kau pencet, bertagai. Oh, dah. 